Hey everybody, how y'all doing? It is Self-Care Sunday and um, I got a few things I want to share with you all. I am heading into five weeks post-op this Tuesday for me having the myomectomy and seven weeks post-op for me having the UFE. Um, I woke up this morning and so much of the swelling has went down where I had the surgery um, and I, I attribute that to um, me drinking the fresh celery juice, the fresh watermelon juice, pineapple juice, of course, water uh, with vitamin C and lysine, and then also um, uh, herbs, been drinking herbs. But what I wanted to get on here and tell you all today, um, this channel is uh, Divine Clementine Bath and Body, and we are a all natural uh, handmade goat's milk and coconut milk, small batch bath and body product company located in Atlanta, Georgia. Um, but we also, uh, do women's wellness, um, um, topics and services. Okay. Uh, dance, fitness, nutrition, and juicing, blood type nutrition. I want to share with you all, um, as far as like aging goes, and this is going to be an ongoing conversation. I am 49. I will be 50 in December. And what I've noticed about aging for me is everything that I wanted to be bigger when I was growing up um, has, my body has settled into what it's going to be. And I've noticed that my breasts have gotten bigger. My butt has gotten bigger. Not as much as uh, I thought it would, but at the end of the day, I am satisfied with my body. But also I want to share something else with you all. Because I hear so many people talking about, oh, I'm going to stop eating meat or, oh, I'm going plant-based. Y'all, we can't be doing these things because you will miss some nutrients that you need if you don't understand your makeup, your personal makeup. But also what I subscribe to is the eat right for your type lifestyle. Blood type, blood type, blood type, blood type. I cannot talk enough about the blood type. The blood type holds the keys to the mat, the magic that lay, lies within your body, lies within your cells. I cannot talk about it enough. I started the blood type diet. I actually picked up this book back in 2004 when I was working at Whole Foods on Ponce de Leon in Atlanta. I actually opened that store. Um, I was one of the front end cashiers and I helped open that store, put things on the counters and on the shelves. I'm sorry, on the shelves. But I picked up that book and looked at that book briefly. And some of the things that I had a natural aversion to, some of the things that I did not like when I was growing up, I was not supposed to have for my blood type. And uh, one of those things is dairy and cheese. Can't stand cheese. I hate it. I always took the cheese off my pizza when I was a little girl. Then when I look at the Eat Right For Your Type book, it says that my blood type is supposed to wait, stay away from dairy. I ain't never like no milk, none of that. So long story short, because I don't want this to be a long drawn out video, uh, I'll be sharing more about this topic, but I wanted to jump on here today. The blood type lifestyle is the way to go. And... One more thing, I actually um, was taking some herbs for my condition, trying to shrink fibroids and come to find out those herbs weren't meant for my blood type. It almost threw me into an early menopause and made my hair come out in the back, which was basically my liver saying, you're doing something that you're not supposed to be doing, okay? We do so much in this uh, society that is basically based on convenience and rushing. And I found that in my 40s, the decade that I decided to slow down and pull away from mainstream society was the decade that I actually found a rhythm with what I needed for my own body, okay? And everything that I've slowed down for and applied to my life I'm so grateful because it has me looking great for my age, aging gracefully. Um, these young girls, they're getting these surgeries and they're not even fully mature. They're not even in their real bodies yet. So we're going to have more conversations around this. Um, but make sure you check out our website, 
we have goat's milk and coconut milk uh, products that you can use from head to toe. We get our goat's milk from a local farm here in Atlanta, so 40-acre goat farm called Decimal Place Farms. The lady that runs it, her name is Mary Higdon. She's a really, really great uh, proprietor of her land and of her goats. We've been dealing with her for 10 years. And um, our products really speak for themselves. You see my skin. And I'm 49. So anyway, y'all, uh, it's Self Care Sunday. Please make sure that you are taking care of yourself. And uh, if you need some help with that, hit us up. We got you. All right. Thanks for watching. Peace.